I'm a southern boy. <laughs> Grew up in the south and have a tremendous love for music. I've been a musician basically since I was about 15 years old and began playing music in various bands in, in high school. Um, musician, guitar player, followed by amp builder, in that order. Building amplifiers, um, I, I believe I got mechanic, I was forced to be mechanically inclined uh, at an early age because if you wanted to drive at my house you had to uh, you had to be able to work on a, on a motorcycle or work on a car um, and as I bought guitars and bought amplifiers I wanted to learn about how they worked and the inner mechanism of them so uh, you know you tear stuff apart you put it back together you try and learn you know how it works and why it works the way it does um, and I've always been a hands-on type person I like to do things with my hands and I like to find out how things operate and um, working on some amplifiers early after I purchased them probably the late 70s uh, that was how I first started learning how to work on amplifiers uh, beyond that I did about 17 years as a bench technician uh, working on amplifiers and things related to DC electronics. <laughs> I think because my heroes were playing. Uh, the Allman Brothers were playing, the, the Marshall Amps, Eric Clapton, uh, Paul Kossoff from the band Free. Uh, they, they were just very prominent. Uh, in most of the band's back lines that I was seeing. Um, we were fortunate enough to have be close to a, a concert hall where I grew up and we would go see bands just about every other weekend. And the Marshall Amps were always in the back line. And uh, those bands, uh, the guitar players, I wanted to emulate them and wanted to get that sound and so I searched out some Marshall amps and began using them. 